Good evening, everybody. How are you today? Hello, hello. Welcome, Lila. Welcome, Juan Campos, Denis, Isaura. Uh, I'm very happy to have you here. Um, Ricardo, Gabriela, Patricia, Elvin, Rita. Uh, thank you for being here because I know that uh, it's a little bit difficult right now because of the rain. So I hope that everything is going to be okay with our class tonight. Um, and I expect that people is, is start connecting little by little, right? So welcome, Dennis. Um, I just would like to know that you can watch my screen. Pueden ver mi pantalla? Yes, yes. Okay, perfect. Yes. I just want yes. to, uh, yeah, yes. thank you. I just want to let you know that we are going to work with the 1.5 lesson objective that says, by the end of this lecture, participants will be able to spell their names and of others. So that, that will be like the second part of the class because during the first uh, part of the class, we are going to uh, complete the topic we studied yesterday about the possessive adjectives and tonight we are going to study the possessive uh, pronouns so after that we will cover this topic and then in the platform you have this video about the alphabet so you can go and watch the video right and continue practicing in order that you can pronounce the letters and that you don't conf uh, get confused with the pronunciation right uh, later, you have the 1.7 knowledge check that says spelling names, right? In here, what you have to do is to listen, right? To listen to this audio. In order to do that, what you have to do is to open this pop-up external window, and then you can download the audio, and you can listen one, two, three, four, five and on more times in order that you can be uh, sure that you can <clears throat> make sure that you are uh, writing the right answer. Again, if you have any difficulty, uh, you can let us know in the WhatsApp group and we can help you. So this is going to be the exercise of the platform that you have to complete by the end of this class. And then uh, for tomorrow, we are going to continue with um, the lesson objective 1.8, which is about the questions using verb to be. So I'm going to stop sharing the platform right now in order that uh, you can watch the screen that I have tonight for you. Good evening. Good evening, welcome my dear. Excuse me, I'm late. Don't worry, you are okay. Um, remember that I will connect uh, like a couple of minutes before the class. Uh, because um, I need to be on time. So you can go uh, little by little, you can arrive, you can connect. And the idea is that can, we can be together at eight o'clock. Okay, for tonight, um, if you remember, last night, uh, can you watch my screen, excuse me? Pueden ver mi pantalla, mi nueva pantalla? Yes, I can see. Okay, perfect. Yes, um, excellent. Uh, so, uh, last night we studied the possessive adjectives. We learned the difference between the subject pronouns and the uh, uh, possessive uh, adjectives. Now we are going to learn the difference between the possessive adjectives and the possessive pronouns. For example, um, in order to say that I have something and to show uh, my object, I can say, this is my book, right? If you see, in the blue color, we have the possessive adjective. For the subject pronoun your, we use your, it's the same. Is this your umbrella? His for he. He lent me his jacket. Her for, um, for she, right? I borrowed her car, right? Uh, so we, when we talk about something that belongs to a lady or to she, we use her. It's, do you like my dog? These are its clothes. Our, a lot of our friends came to our party. Your, are these your kids? There, their house is lovely. 
So if you see normally the position of the possessive adjectives are at the beginning or in the middle of the sentence, right? Because they are modifying a noun. Si usted se fija, lo voy a decir esto en español, ¿verdad? Para que quede bien clarito. Eh, la estructura que tiene es que el possessive adjective está eh, antes de un nombre o sustantivo, ¿sí? De un noun. En este caso, eh, book is a noun. Umbrella is a noun, a jacket is a yep. noun, car is a noun, clothes is a noun, party is a noun, kit is a noun, house is a noun. So in this case, you can say that you have possessive adjective plus a noun, like it says here, right? Now we are going to see uh, the uh, possessive pronouns, right? In the case of possessive pronouns, they normally go after um, the verb to be. Normalmente van después de un verb to be, but they don't modify, right? Si usted se fija, ya no modifican uh, nada, ¿verdad? Uh, and normally, they are at the end of the sentence. Uh, in order to avoid, I'm going to mute you all by now, and then I will open the mic, okay? Okay, here. Um, for example, I say, mine, the book is mine, okay? The book is mine. El libro es mío, ya no es mi libro, sino el libro es mío, mine, yours. The umbrella is yours. La sombrilla es tuya. His, the jacket is his. La um, chaqueta es de él, ¿verdad? Hers, the blue car is hers. El carro azul es de ella. Ours. The clothes are ours. Las ropas o la ropa es nuestra, ¿verdad? Yours. The children are yours. Los niños son de ustedes. ¿verdad? Their. Their house is theirs. Excuse me, the children are yours. Sí, los niños son de ustedes. And their house is theirs. La casa es de ellos. So, basically, the difference is that, uh, in this case, the possessive, the possessive pro, uh, pronoun goes at the end of the sentence but there, is, there are no nouns, ¿verdad? En este caso ya no hay ningún sustantivo al que haya que eh, modificar. So let's continue in order to advance with it, this topic. And I have here some exa eh, examples for you, some exercises. We have got a bike. So this bike is, this is, what do you think it, it should be? ¿Cuál creen ustedes que debe ir ahí? Excuse me, okay. This is my or mine? Mine. My. My, ¿verdad? Está, my. En el, está en el medio, ¿verdad? It's in the middle. And it is modifying the noun bike. So, this is my bike. And here, the bike is? Mine. 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 Right? The mine. bike is mine. Okay. Perfect. Excellent. So you're ident identifying very, very good. Uh, okay. He has got a ball. This is? My. He. In this case, we're talking Hell. about he. He. His. Uh, his, right? This is his ball, right? His ball. Okay, excellent. Uh, so, um, and in the other one, the bow is? His. Yes, it's the same, His. right? But in this case, um, we are talking about the adjective, not the, uh, I mean the problem, not the adjective, okay? Okay, next one. I, I have got a book. This is? This is my. 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 Yes. Excellent. This is this my is book. book. My. Okay. And what about the next one? The book is? Mine. My. 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 It's like this one, like the first one. My. Okay. Excellent. Very good. Okay. So what about this one? You have got a dog. This is you. We're talking about is. 
No, in this case, you are right. My, my phone. Look that the pronoun is what we are talking about, your. This is your. Okay. So, in the next one, the dog is? Yours. Okay. Yours. Very good. Yours. Oh, this is a pronoun, right? Okay, what about the next? She got a cake. She got a cake. Oh, yeah, no eh, sí, quien tiene el tele, mi amigo, chicos, eh, si no vamos a tener que poner el mute un ratito porque ya no se escucha. Ok, thank you very much. Vamos a ver. Quizás lo vamos a poner el mute otra vez. Y me ayudan ustedes abriendo el mic, quien va a ir participando, ¿verdad? Yo voy a ir tratando también de hacerlo. She's got a cake. This is cake. Her. So this is her cake. Her, right? Estamos hablando de ella, ¿verdad? She. Entonces, this is her. her. Excuse me. I moved the other one. Okay, this is her cake, right? And what about the, the other one? The, the possessive. Um, this is the blue one. Right? Is the possessive adjective. But the red one is the possessive pronoun. The cake Her. is? Her. Her. Hers. 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 Very Hers. good. Excellent. So it's in red because it's a possessive Hers. pronoun. Pronoun. Okay? They have got a dog. This is? I got a dog. This is? Your dog, your dog. There. There. Okay. There. 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 Okay. They Dare. have a dog. This is their dog. Okay. This is the possessive adjective in blue. Right? And now we are going to write the possessive adjective. I mean the possessive pronoun. This dog is? There's. There. Okay. Perfect. Dare. And we have to add an Dare's. Excellent. So we write it in red because we are talking about a possessive pronoun. Okay, let's work on the last three. I have got a book. This is? My. My book. Okay. My, my, the my book, book is? My. Okay, my. excellent. Mine is a possessive Pronoun, mine, and my is a possessive adjective. Okay, very good. And what about the other? I have got a kite. This is? This is mine. My kite, right? The my kite, kite is? Mine. Mine. Okay. Similar to the first one. Similar a la primera. Teacher. Adelante. Can I do an answer? Yes. Please. Ask me. Uh, uh, why uh, will you use uh, uh, God? Why do I I couldn't understand the question. Could you please repeat it again? Uh, what do I do? Uh, why will you uh, uh, we use uh, the God? Ah, I got. Es como uh, yes. conseguir. Conseguir una. Oh, es como tener, ¿verdad? I have got a kite. Conseguí uh -huh. una piscucha. ¿Verdad? O, yeah. Obtuve una piscucha. ¿Sí? Uh, yes. Ok. No, no podemos decir solamente yo tengo una piscucha, sino que, o sea, el, el have got significa como que yo conseguí. Obtuve, obtuve, conseguí. Obtuve. Tengo. Exacto. Uh -huh. Exacto. Okay, thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Okay, you have got a cat. This is? Yours. Yours. Yes, okay. Okay. This is your cat. Okay, let me write it capitals. I'm going to write it in mayúscula. Okay, the cat is? Yours. Yours. Yours, right? Excellent. Perfect. Yours. Okay, so the idea is that you can identify the possessive adjectives. Uh, uh, in, the, in this uh, case, the platform, 
is um, making a, a, a special emphasis on the possessive adjectives, but you also need to know about the possessive uh, pronouns, which, uh, which are these uh, words, um, excuse me, that I have, um, that I have um, remarked in red color, right? So you need to know that they are different and that the possessive pronouns go at the end and that they don't modify a noun like the adjective, okay? Remember that always an adjective modifies a noun. Okay, perfect, so let's advance. Okay, so uh, in this case, the first activity for you um, in order to close this topic is to complete this, okay? So the instruction here, let me, let me show you. The instruction says, um, fill in the blanks with the possessive adjectives. My, your, his, her, it's, our, your, and their. Aquí ya volvemos de nuevo a los possessive adjectives, que es lo que hace énfasis la plataforma, ¿verdad? Yo quise enseñarle adicionalmente los possessive pronouns porque usted más adelante los va a ver, ¿verdad? Ahí para que los reconozca, pero por ahora estamos haciendo énfasis en my, your, his, her, its, our, your, and their. So, what I want you to do is to please take a picture on this material that I have prepared for you, and we are going to work uh, again in groups, and I expect that you can divide this uh, activity and that you can complete it, okay? So you can take a picture, maybe better than mine, and then I'm going to send you right now Okay, so the idea is that you can answer uh, the most that you can uh, of the 16 questions in uh, five minutes. So you will have five minutes to do this, okay? If you can take a better picture than mine, it's okay that you can send it to the group. Si usted quiere tomar una imagen y enviarla al grupo, eh, puede hacerlo, ¿verdad? Yo les acabo de enviar también una. Okay, do you have questions? Tenemos preguntas de lo que vamos a hacer. Questions so far? No? Yeah, yes, teacher. Adelante, tenemos preguntas. Uh, ¿Qué es lo que vamos a hacer en sí? O sea, vamos a llenar los espacios. You need to fill the, as it says, fill the blanks, llenar los espacios. Yes. The possessive adjectives. Con los adjetivos posesivos, mm. my, your, his, her, its, our, your, and their. So what you have to pay attention? You need to pay attention to what we are talking about. For example, in this, we are talking about the classroom, okay? Um, in here, we are talking about uh, Susan Spen. So, about uh, uh, Susan Spen. In this case, uh, your name, right? Because here it says, my name is Thomas. So you need to look for which is better adapts or which better fills the the question, okay? Tenemos que ver cuál de todos se adapta mejor o llena de mejor manera el espacio, ¿verdad? Sí, pero so, eso, eso lo vamos a hacer en... En, en grupo, ahorita. Ah, ahorita, en grupo, ok, ok. okay ahorita okay. los mando. I understand. La invitación, ok? So let me eh, open the breakout rooms. Ok. So I'm going to create the rooms and I'm going to send you the invitation now. Remember that this class is mostly for you to practice and for you to speak in English and for you to work with your classmates and do your best in order to uh, speak the most you can. Yes, I like this picture. Yes, much better than mine. Excellent, thank you. Okay, you can say join, you can choose join in order to go to the breakout rooms. Démosle aceptar, ¿verdad? La invitación, o join, unirse. Hello, Isaura. 
Are you able to communicate with Lila and Elvin? Hello, hello, hello. hello. Okay, hello. Elvin is there. Hello, everybody. Elvin, it's good to have you here. Okay, here is Isaura, so you can work together, right? Right. Okay, I'll leave you in order that you can work and I'll come back if you need me and I will go around the groups, okay? Thank you. Ajá, uh -huh, porque la respuesta dice My name is Thomas Is Thomas, ajá Tiene que ser mi Hello, is everything okay, my dears? Do you have a question? No? No uh, is, okay. Estamos rellenando Ok, <laughs> you, you do your best Ok, you do your best You don't worry if you make mistakes We can correct later, ok? You just continue advancing okay. Thank you. See you okay. in a minute. Okay. Ahí en, ajá, ahí en ti. Yes. I, I, I think this is her book. Y las cinco, ah, sí. uh, they. They, no, our, our, no. our name, um, Kevin and Tua. Excellent. You're doing a great job, my dears. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> okay. I leave you because I see you're working. So I'll call you uh, in a couple of minutes. Okay. You just continue. Okay. Hello. Entonces sería, is that your pain? O sea, your. ¿Hola? Sí. Ajá, sería your. Your. Uh, Susan, is that your pain on the table? Okay. okay. Sería your, ¿verdad? Yes, that's right. Excellent. That's right. You're doing okay. a great job. Okay, I leave you and I go to look for the other groups. So if you need me, you can call me, okay? We have like uh, two and a half more minutes to complete the activity. Thank you. Okay, teacher. And then number three. Ahí sería yo. ¿Cuál es tu, eh, ¿Cuál es tu, tu número, número de teléfono? teléfono. Ajá. My phone number is. Eh, ta, 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 ta. Ahí sería my después. My phone number. Hello, how is it going? Is everything okay here? Sí, vamos un poco bien. Excellent. I like to hear that. Okay. So we have just Gracias. like two more minutes in order to finish the activity and then I'll call you back. Okay. 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 See you. Pongámosle más y tal vez ojalá que salga bien. Hello, how wow. is it going? Is everything okay? Es que, perdón, eh, la cuatro. Help, creo okay. que esto es, creo que esto es mi libro, sería. No, eh, look for no. the next part of the sentence. It says, I think this is book. She dropped it on the floor. So we are talking about she. Sí. Es sí. como que alguien pasó, ¿verdad? Y se cayó un libro. Entonces, la otra persona dice, I think is, ¿cuál sería para she? The her, ¿verdad? Her. Her. Uh -huh. her. Uh -huh. I think is, her. I think this is her. Her. Her book, right? Uh, she dropped it on the floor. Lo dejó caer en el piso. Uh, ella, uh -huh. ella dejó caer en el piso. Okay. 
Do you have okay. any questions? Tenemos más preguntas? Por el momento no. No? Okay. We have like one minute mm -hmm. and a half in order to complete the exercise. No, los, no los compañeros. So I call you back, okay? See you in a minute. No, aquí sería no. He, uh -huh. his, nombre, no. His, his name. name. No. No sería sus nombres, sería your your. Your. Como este dos, ¿verdad? Your name. Ajá, es que es que dice sus nombres. Ajá, sería your name. Your name. Your name. Hello, my name. Sí, sería yo. Hello, my name. Hola, hola, can you hear me? Hello. Hello. Uh, uh, which teacher, question are you working with? ¿En qué pregunta están? Para ver si les puedo ayudar. Okay. Uh, bye. Bye. Number nine. Bye. Okay. If you see, it says the children are crying because they can find. Entonces, como estamos hablando de they, ¿verdad? ¿Cuál sería el que corresponde? They. They. Because they, they. Can find their toys. Yes. Because we are talking they. about they. Estamos hablando de ellos, ¿verdad? De, lo, de los niños que están llorando porque no encuentran sus juguetes de ellos. They are. Mm, yes. They are. Yes. They are. They are. Their names are Kevin and Steve. Yes, yes, that's uh, right. Yes, because we're talking about two people. They. They. they, they. Okay. They. okay. Excellent. Okay, uh, see you in a minute, okay? We are about to finish this activity. Okay. So I'll call you back. Okay. okay, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. For the ubicación. Me, Seria, my. For, um... Hello, hello. How is it going? Hola. Hello. Hola, Hola teacher. Hola. ¿Cómo va? Hello. Por aquí. Sí, 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 en, en, el, en el ejercicio 11, porque dice, I really like my new home, especially location. Sería, podríamos utilizar el it's para el yes. a un lugar. Yes, because we are talking about the house, right? So, uh, the, uh, the, the subject pronoun for the house is it. So, it's right to say, I like it or I love it because of its location. That would be ah, okay. su, su ubicación de la casa. It, right? Okay. Okay, excellent. We are about to finish this activity, so I'll call you back. Okay? And then, uh, continue the main. Okay? Okay. Okay. Hello, welcome back. Hola, hola, bienvenido, bienvenidas. How was the practice? ¿Cómo estuvo la práctica? Ajá, let's see, people is coming back. Creo que solo yo estoy, teacher. Hola, Alexia, la sacó el sistema. Sí. Siento, es, ya vamos a, ya ahorita lo llamé, ya van a incorporarse todos y ahí eh, resolvemos. Que lo siento, perdón que andaba en la ruta y no, no vi que, que la había sacado, pero ya, está, ya estábamos finalizando. Sí, no hay okay. problema. Ok, sorry. Ok, so people is coming back. Hello, hello. Okay, hello. just a couple of seconds in order that all the people is in the class. And then we will try to solve the exercise together. Okay, so just 17 seconds and we are going to be as a whole. Okay, so because of the time, uh, in 10 seconds more people is coming back. So I would like to ask you, um, voluntarily, who can help us in order to complete this? Okay? Who would like to start? 
Okay, where is? My. My, okay. But look, here we have we. So it seems that there are more, more than one people looking for one classroom. So for we, which is the right possessive in this case? Or. Our. our, right? Okay, perfect. So where is our classroom? We can find it, okay? Okay, Susan, is that? My hair. Okay, this is very interesting. It, Susan is she, but it seems, okay, look, uh, Susan is she, but it seems that I'm talking to her, right? Susan certamente es ella, ¿verdad? Pero la oración es redactada de manera que yo le estoy Susan, y le digo, Susan, is that your pen on the pen? It's. Susan, ¿es esta tu pluma sobre la mesa? Your. ¿Verdad? Your. Porque le estoy hablando a ella directamente. Is. Ok. So, number three. What is? My. Your. My. Your name. No. What is your name? Estoy preguntando. ¿Cuál es tu nombre? ¿Esta persona me responde? My name is Tom. Okay. Number four, I think is Luego dice she. Her. Her. Okay, I think her book. She dropped it on the floor. Okay, so uh, number five, names are Kevin and Stuart. There. Okay. There you because we are talking about two people, okay? So, uh, they and the person, uh, I mean the adjective, the particular adjective is they. He forgot to write. Why? You're. You're. Pero dice he. Vean, dice he. His, right? His, porque dice he. He forgot to write his name. Él, él olvidó escribir su nombre de él en el test, ¿verdad? What is your phone? Yes. What is your phone number? Estoy preguntándote a ti. What is your phone number? La otra persona responde. My. My. My, right? My phone number is. Five 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 nine eight. Okay. Uh, because of the time, my dears, we are going to stop here. Vamos a ver si las logramos terminar. Ya vamos a la mitad y el tiempo va rápido. Did the cat eat all of food? My. Del gato. My. 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 It's okay. It's el gatito es it, ¿verdad? Porque es un animal, aunque lo queremos mucho, pero es un animalito. Entonces es it. Cuando it's food, su comida. Okay. The children are crying because they can find their 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 toys. Pueden encontrar sus juguetes de ellos. ¿verdad? Aquí estamos usando acuerdo. El possessive adjective, entonces no lleva ese. El que lleva ese es el possessive pronoun que va al final de la oración, pero ese va en el medio. Ok, uh, oops, sorry. Um, let's see. Um, Miriam and Jennifer. What about Miriam and Jennifer? Like her. Yeah. Ok, pero vea, son dos chicas. Entonces, yeah. 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 ok, yeah. porque aunque son chicas, pero son, es más de una, ¿verdad? Son ellas. Le corresponde yeah. okay. there. Ok, uh, I really like my new home, especially. It's, it, it's right? It's. Because I'm talking about the home, okay? So the, the home is a house, so it's an object. 
Okay, this is a picture of your father. I mean, this is a picture of my friend. He is my my my, my best. My. Okay. My. Next one. Um, do you think your father likes? He 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 he. Who then is his birthday present? Okay, su regalo de cumpleaños. We still have 20 more minutes before class begins. Estamos hablando de we. Entonces, ¿cuál corresponde? Hour. Hour. Ok, tenemos 20 minutos para que nuestra clase. Ok, Brazil is located in South America. Capital C is Brasilia. It's, 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 right? Because Brazil is a country, so it corresponds to it. Okay. It's. Um, when is by, in this case, is here. Uh -huh. <laughs> Television. Estamos hablando de Mr. and Mrs. Smith. They. ¿Cuál le corresponde? They. 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 Estamos hablando de ellos, ¿verdad? Entonces, ellos. Su televisión de ellos. ¿Cuándo compraron? Ellos? Ok, thank you very much. Congratulations for your no. effort. Exercise. I'm going to mute all of you because I will continue with the class. And thank you for your participation right now. Uh, with this, we're finished this part of the of the platform. So I will ask you to please go and complete the exercise that corresponds to the possessive adjective. Disculpe. Ajá, perdón. Eh, perdone, eh, una pregunta. Eh, la, la número, las primeras cuatro, dice, ¿cómo era? Perdone. Las primeras cuatro. Eh, El ejercicio. El ejercicio, ah, perdón, eh, voy a tratar de, permítanme, fíjense que la cerré. A ver, eh, okay. déjenme La primera abrir. era our. Ah, sí, si me ayuda ahí alguien que, si no, no se preocupen, yo les puedo mandar una captura de pantalla después, ¿sí? Eh, pero si me ayuda la compañera, ¿era our? Sí, la primera era our, la segunda es your, mm -hmm. la tercera también era your. Uh -huh. Y la cuatro era hair. Ok, thank you. Thank you very much. I can send yes. the picture later if you want. Ok, my dears. Because of the time, I'm going to start sharing the next topic of this class. Vamos a continuar con el siguiente tema de esta clase, which is the alphabet. ¿Verdad? Es el alfabeto. Eh, les voy a poner mute a todos porque sí necesito que me escuchen. A mí, sin ninguna interferencia, les agradezco su comprensión. So, what we are going to do is that I'm going to repeat each letter, and I hope that you can do the same at home, but with your mics mute, ¿ok? Yo voy a repetir cada letra y cada eh, palabrita que está en azul, y quiero que usted haga lo mismo en casa, pero que no se quite el mute del micrófono para que no se nos oiga eh, una sola interferencia y que me puedan escuchar y usted pueda repetir, pero en modo mute. Ok. A, as in apple. B, as in B. C, as in cat. D, as in dog. E, as in elephant. F, as in flower. G, like, like as in goose, right? H, as in horse. I, as in ice cream. J, J, uh, J as in juice. K, as in cake. L, as in lion. M, as in monkey. N, as in nut. O, as in orange. P, like in pig, Q, like in queen, R, like in rabbit, S, as in sun, T, in tomato, U, as universe, V, like in violet, W, like in wolf, X, like in xylophone, Y, like in judge, Z, Z like in zebra, 
Okay? So now, let me repeat and you repeat in mute mode. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Okay, so for this part, we are going to have an exercise which consists in asking our, how do we spell our names, okay? Spell is deletrear. How do you spell your name? If you ask me, how do you spell your name? I say P A T R I C I A. Vea que con la I y la A, sometimes it's a little bit uh, difficult to, um, to remember and sometimes we get confused with these two letters. So what I did in order to avoid a confusion is to remember that I is like the subject pronoun yo, I. ¿verdad? Entonces ya no se me olvida que la I es I y que la otra es A. Y que también puedo grabarme la cancioncita, ¿verdad? A, B, C, D, E, F, G. ¿verdad? Entonces, so that's what I did in order to avoid any confusion with I and A. So, if you ask me, teacher, how do you spell your last name? I say M O R A N, Moran. Okay? So, what I want you to do now is that you do the exercise of writing your name and try to spell it, okay? You will have one minute to do that, and then we will go to the breakout rooms and we will practice with our classmates. So you have to ask your classmate, excuse me, how do you spell your name? And the other person says P-A-T-R-I-C-I-A, -I -I Patricia. Excuse me, how do you spell your last name? M-O-R-A-N, Moran. And the other person can say thank you, right? Remember always to say thank you when you ask something to someone else. Okay, if you can take a picture, it's going to be right. Si le puede tomar una imagen, eh, hágalo. I will do it right now and I'll send it to you. Okay. And I'll send the one from the alphabet for you to have it. Let me go back. Okay, so I'm going to take a picture. So let me hide this. If you can take a picture, it's going to be okay. Okay, perfect. So I'm going to stop sharing and then I'm going to go back to the breakout rooms and I'll send you the invitations again. Do you have questions on what we are going to do? Tenemos preguntas de lo que vamos a hacer? Okay, please join. Por favor, se pueden ir uniendo ya. La invitación ya debió haberle llegado.
Ok, voy yo. Cristian es C-H-R-E-A-I-S-T-A-I-N. Ok, very good. I like it. Ok, Elwin es e d w W A N A R E no J U I R E Z <laughs> No, 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 me acuerdo. Jay, alguien más que no haga. Can I help you? Eh, ¿Puedo ayudarle, Hilda? Hello, I'm here. Hola. Sí, este. Su sí, nombre. La... ¿Cuál le sí. cuesta? No, la J. Sí. Ah, Jay. 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 U. A. Jay. 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 R. R. I. Sí, sí, no sé. Sí, sí. La es I y luego Z. Eh, la Z también le dicen Z, pero en, en el alfabeto es Z, ¿verdad? Es z, z, como que fuera zumbidito de abejita, z, z, vibrando. Z. 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 <risa> That's right. Z. Yes. Excellent. Okay. Excellent. Please continue practicing. You have like a couple of minutes to continue, ¿ok? See you later. Ok. Uh, voy a deletrear. C. A. R. 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 Y. ¿Dónde está la I? ¿Dónde está? I. Eh, es un águila eh, con eh, eh, R es um, quiero ver. O, eh, o, 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 ajá, sí, o, o en, eh, en, en, excelente. Gerson, eh, eh, la E se dice I, ¿verdad? ¿Sí? Sí. Entonces sería G-E. G-E. R S R S O N. Gerson. Sí. Que se me traba un poco la lengua. No se preocupe, Gerson. Para eso estamos, para ir aprendiendo poquito a poco. Solo es porque okay. lo escuché que pronunció la E de otra manera. Entonces la E es I. Oiga. Y I. La, A es la I, I, la A, la I y la E. Son como. Bueno, igual a mí me confunden. Sí. Ah, ajá, yo hice lo que les mencionaba. <risa> Utilicé ese truco de para no confundir la, la I. Recordaba que el pronombre personal es I, yo. Entonces con eso yo logré vencer y, y ya no confundirla. Eh, ah, la, okay. la E tuve que grabarme que en inglés es I y eh, la otra eh, me aprendí la cancioncita de A, B, C, D, E, F, G entonces yo sé que comienza con A, B, C entonces la A es A eh, so that, that's my secret ese es mi secreto, así me las aprendí para no confundirla <laughs> ah, ok thank you. Thank, you. Okay. Okay. thank you see you in a minute ok entonces sigo uh, my name is Gabriela Gómez puede uh, deletrear su nombre can you spell your name uh, 
Como que está diciendo el abecedario, ok? Tell me, please. Okay. I want to listen you. Okay. Uh, may I help you? If you let me. D. Ok, D. G. G. A. G. G. <laughs> A. A. Hello, hello, how is it going? ¿Cómo vamos por acá? Hello. Finish? Hello. Did you finish? ¿Terminaron? Did you sí, finish? sí, yes. Excellent, excellent. I'll call you back in a minute, okay? In a minute we will see you in the, in the main book. Okay. okay. Hello, hello, how is it going? Did you finish the practice? Yes. Excellent. Yeah. Were you able to spell your name and last name? Yes. Excellent, perfect. Yeah. I'll call you back in a minute, okay? Yeah. Okay. My Excellent. last name is you are E -A. Excellent. <laughs> okay, <laughs> we've finished the exercise, so I'll call you back now to the main room and then we will continue practicing there. Okay? Okay. okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Hello, hello, welcome back. Who was the practice? Bienvenido, bienvenidas. ¿Cómo estuvo esa práctica? Were you able to... Algo difícil. I know, I know, but uh, remember that the practice uh, it per, uh, it helps you to go little by little uh, until you reach perfection in the pronunciation of the letters. So remember that practice makes the master. So you will be the master by practicing the letters, no matter if you make mistakes. That's why you need to practice, ¿verdad? No se preocupe, ¿verdad? Si usted se equivoca en las primeras veces, recuerda que la práctica hace al maestro. So you need to continue practicing. So I will invite you to go to the platform and to watch the video that is, um, that is there. So you can play and replay and Listen many, many times until you get the right pronunciation of the letter that uh, it's difficult for you. I know that A, E, and I are, are a little bit confusing, but as I said before, if you remember that I is also the personal pronoun, yo, I, it's going to be easy. Uh, also try to memorize. I learn like a song, like a children's song, like A, B, C, D, E, F, G, and it helped me a lot in order to recognize that the A is A, right? And I have to change my mind that E, lo que nos conocemos por E en español es E, it's E in English, right? So it changes. So I would like to ask, who would like to start? I need sure. two volunteers, two, volu two groups, two teams, two volunteer teams in order to show us how do you, how to, how do you spell your names, okay? Necesitamos dos grupos voluntarios para que nos compartan cómo eh, deletrean sus nombres. Okay. So who would like to start? ¿A quién le gustaría comenzar? Vamos a ver, chicos. A. Ok, D. Pero, pero perdón, eh, me gustaría que hagan la pequeña conversación como, hello, how do you spell your name? Esta. How do you spell your name? Y, la, y usted contesta y luego la persona pregunta el apellido y usted contesta, ¿sí? ¿Quién era el compañero sí. de mi voluntaria? Yo le puedo ayudar, no hay problema. Eh, thank you, thank you very much. Ok, you can start. Podemos comenzar. Uh, hello, how do you spell your name? Okay, 
es A, D, R, E, I, no. Ay. Ok, al final dice el teletreo y dice su nombre, ¿verdad? Para, para, ok. okay? Repeat. Repeat, please. Es A, D, R, I, E, A, N, A. Adriana. Excellent. I understood. Adriana. Yes, I guess. Thank you. And now, now the last name. Uh, last, 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 Okay. A M A Y A. Okay. Amaya. Amaya, excellent. Very good. Thank you, my dear. Now, would you like to ask to Isaura eh, para cerrar el círculo? Eh, gracias, Isaura. Okay. Thank you. Eh, ¿Puede usted, Adriana, preguntarle a Isaura para cerrar el círculo? How are you speak your name? My name is I S A U R A. Isaura. Excellent. Now about the last name. How would you speak your last name? C U R E A. Okay, Corea. Corea. Right. Excellent. So O, O, right? O, C, O, Corea. La O es O. Thank you, Isaura, and thank you. Oh. Um, yes, yes. Uh, thank you very much you, uh, to thank you ladies for participating and for showing us. Okay, who else? ¿Quién más? Necesito un, un, un par de voluntarios más. Todavía nos quedan un par de minutos. Let's see, let's see. No. No. Adelante, Griselda. Es ok, um, yo estaba en grupo con Gabriela, Gabi. Ok, Gabi, okay, ayúdame. Yo le hago las preguntas. Ok, <ríe> recuerden que vamos a hacer la inversa también, vea. <ríe> ok, um, you can uh, start. How do you spell your name? Um, uh, my name is Griselda, es D R I S T -E el D I A A verdad A A es la I okay Excellent. ah perdón A A al uh -huh. final okay uh -huh. how do you spell last name uh, my last last name is Castro is C A S T R O Excellent. thank you thank you now you ask Griselda ahora usted pregúntele a Gaby Okay, Gabi, how do you spell your name? D A B Y. Okay. Thank you. How do you spell your last name? C I R O N. Thank you. Okay. Seron. Seron, dijo el otro, ¿verdad? Sí, excellent. Sí. Thank you very much. <laughs> Okay, my dears, because of your time, I need to stop here, but I would like to invite you to please go and uh, please uh, continue practicing, right, in a platform and uh, until you can master the uh, pronunciation of the alphabet, please, okay? Uh, remember that you need to go and uh, look for the exercises, the pending exercises of each class in the platform. So. Uh, you can uh, complete uh, until the section that we have studied today, okay? Okay, uh, if you have okay. questions, you can let me know in the chat and I can help you whenever you need my, my support, okay? Take care and Thank see you. you. Be safe. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye.